Off top, run a nigga out of socks Niggas talk more than bitches, niggas really be on cock though Just fuck the whole out in France, paint a face like Picasso I iced all my vatos, I'm really yeah. a big ass beamer Big bands in my Bentley necks Don't play around on my phone, ho, give me sex Watch on my wrist, out of date, but it's Rolex Grizzly up next, I'm up now, stop your bullet vest 550, 600 hundreds 720s, let's get straight to it 810s, what's that bands? Hit the store. What's going on guys? It's your boy here, Tommy Boy. And we're back with another video. So today, actually Sunday, I went to the uh, to New York City. Because we live pretty close. I picked up a crazy amount of items. I dropped like a light rack, you know, it's nothing. So, <clears throat> we pretty much went to Palace. Supreme. We went to Palace, Supreme, and Babe. So first I'm going to show you my Palace, my Palace pickup. Some in light, you know, they've had these in stock surprisingly. The uh, Palace P3D t-shirt. Honestly, my favorite colorway was the black one, and luckily I copped that one online. But in store, they only had the white one left in large, so I was like, you know, I might as well. Might as well cop, wear it for a little bit, and then probably sell. You know, we'll see how it fits, and... How it goes, because normally these, these pal shirts are the most comfortable shirts out there. They're quality, some A1, A1 sauce. So I fuck with them heavy. And then, next up is Bape. And as some of you know, Bape had a fire exclusive uh, Paris opening. So in store they had a bunch of, uh, bunch of collaborations of like the different camo of the, with the France colors, which is blue, white, and red. And they had the Bape head tee. All in different colors as well, and the sh shark zip up. And I was able to cop two of those. I got in the store like at one thirty. They opened at like eleven, if I'm if I'm not mistaken, around then. So I got the uh, <coughs> the zip up, like the shark zip up. You know what I mean? In the bag, I got actually two. One for my cousin and Martin Herman, M Herman. This is his XL actually, so I'm not gonna open it. I'm gonna keep it closed. And then I got the L. I got a large actually. I caught the W, but I got a large. Honestly, I think it was extremely, extremely fire. So I'll, I'm gonna go ahead and open it up for you guys. This is definitely a personal cop for now. And if like I don't, if I get tired of it or something, I'll just sell it, I guess. But here it is. It's pretty nice because I like how it's a silver, silver zipper, and the, just the camo is just straight heat, straight heat. So I'm going to toss that aside. That's it for my bait, bait pickups. I was going to pick up a crew neck, but their shit's way overpriced retail. Like, it's crazy if you've ever been in there. Even online, like, I don't know what I'm saying, but online and in-store. It's like two two forty eight for a crew neck. I'm like, y'all bugging. So in total on vape, I spent a solid 200 A light 200 And then at Palace, that t-shirt was only $48. And now we get to the big... Big cream gang. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up the little package up first. So I, so the story is I pretty much went to my brother, so I was able to cop multiples. Luckily, but this was on a Sunday too, so don't forget about that. It wasn't like a Thursday or Friday. Luckily, they had some stuff in on a Sunday. So my first pickup was a Mophie case. It's just a 10k. Nothing, nothing special. You know, I already cop one when they dropped. Actually, I cop two. But here it is, 10k. I think it's really dope. I might keep for keep one and sell one or something. We'll see. Was that also the 20k? The 20k is bigger. I personally liked it a little bit better. So I'll put go ahead, put that to the side as well. And of course, we got the flashlight in red. I thought this was gonna be a lot better actually. This is just like a twistable little flashlight. I wish it was gonna be like a little bigger or something when I first originally saw it online. Then I was in store. I was able to cop online because I was going for the bogos, and this was the restock then. But when I went in store, I was like, damn, this is not what I expected, but it's just still a fire piece, you know, why not? And now, we move on to the big bag right here. Oh, and that in total was around 148 in total. So first, we'll go with the backpack. I'm surprised they still had this in stock. It's a black backpack, you know, it's for NeuroCollab. Retailed for around 148, plus New York City sales tax is insane. You know, we'll take it. That's the Supreme Box logo right here in black. And then written up here. It's like Supreme. I don't know if you guys can see that. That's how it is. 
I honestly, I love the white one. I had the white one, but then I sold it to my uh, brother's friend because he really wanted it for his birthday. So I was like, yeah, you know, why not? I might as well spread the hype. Okay, so then I also got another flashlight, number two. And then I picked up another multi case, number two, another 10K. They didn't have the 20 case in stock, unfortunately, so I just settled for the 10K. Nothing, nothing less than a 20K is still fire. And then I should get a, the mat. This sold out pretty, I th I'm assuming pretty quick online. It says Supreme, there's nothing hot, there's nothing here worth dying for. And then there's a guy with the gun holding it, pointing right at you when you walk in. For now, I'm going to keep this in my room, in my, uh, in my walkway. Just to have, you know, it's like a dope collect collector's piece. A nice little decoration for the crib. Just trying to get that, that crib up. And the last piece, you know, all, all every time I go to Supreme, if you guys have ever been there, they always have, like, third-party brands in there. And I honestly think that's straight fire. Like, even though, like, no one really knows about it or it's not that hyped. I got this this tee. It says, Death in New York, size large. It's probably, it's probably a brand name fucking awesome, which I think is, like, fire. You know, and the tee... Like a BOGO of death in New York. Uh, I think it's Street Heat. I was like, why not? Might as well. I already I got pretty good offers on it too, surprisingly, even though it's not Supreme. So that yeah, the 148 for that, for the two for the Mophie case and the flashlight. Well, there he goes that receipt. And then the the t-shirt was 48. And then the other package with the backpack, the the Mophie case, the flashlight, and the mat was like a total of 348. You know, something light, nothing too heavy. Every time I go there, I'm surprised I actually get this much because everything's out of stock online, of course. All right, so thank you guys for watching. Uh, as you know, my Instagram is HypeNJ. If you want to check out if I'm selling any of these items or if you want to talk, trade, anything, hit me up on there. My personal is at Thomas Severco. And if you guys have any suggestions for any videos, any new ideas, anything you special you want to see, or any comments or criticism, you know, let me know, comment below, message me, whatever you want, because I'm open to it, and uh, let's get this show started. All right, I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching.